introduction. I think after speaking after Meera is a, is a tough call. <laughs> Thank you. 
something which is manageable within our own means and we don't end up borrowing or you know taking a lot of money from people so capital was uh, the first point second point which is very important is that we were getting into a service which everybody needed you know at that point of time what we analyzed analyzed that you know the population of the country which was about 30 years ago 18 19 crores and everybody needs to save and if people save they need to invest so that was the basic principle that we are doing something which everybody needs and and if everybody needs our service you know everybody has to invest so we started out with that principle that we are doing something which is going to add value to people people's life to make their uh, you know financial security better and and that's how we selected the product which had low capital intensive requirement and second was uh, you know it was a product which was needed by one and all and which was to mobilize their savings so this was the second principle that we looked at we see lot of apps and lot of things come up but do they end of the day add value to people's life it makes them richer or are they you know just uh, passing fad which is there for some time and then it just disappears so i think that very strong test one needs to take when one is selecting the kind of uh, business that one wants I think that 
other important thing is of course you know getting money uh, it is beyond the point it is really very difficult to manage without having the working capital and the necessary finance to really take the Very, very 
milestone for success of your venture. Because moment you start feeling that this is a criticism of me, you know, you stop growing. You stop improving your product. You know, you are not able to really, uh, really say that something is really wrong with what I am doing and I need to correct it. And uh, let me tell you, it's not easy thing to do. I mean, I have been through this mental games for a long, long time and it took me many years to, you know, distinguish like, for example, you know, I was uh, with I was working on, you know, changing a lot of uh, systems which were being pro which were being followed. Like in Bombay Stock Exchange, we had a settlement cycle which was 15 days, and it took another three weeks to settle the transaction. So transaction which was done on the first day would get settled after five weeks. It was quite ridiculous. And, and, and the issues involved were so minor. But there was a huge, you know, financial uh, implication of what was happening because the guy who bought on first day he paid to the broker maybe or on fifth day and that money maybe would lie with the broker or it would give the customer five weeks time to pay. So there was money involved in the whole thing. So it was not in interested parties interest to ensure that it happens. And and I was when I was trying to change this system to move to you know T plus seven and then T plus three. Lot of opposition, uh, employee strikes, everything was motivated, and you know it was put there. And Continuously, I was being blamed that, look, you have delayed this, you have done this, because there were teething problems in the system. But I stood fast. And, you know, that was my real first test. Earlier, I would have cried, to be honest. But that was my first test. I said, look, I am not going to get bogged down. I am going to continuously improve what I am doing. And then same, this thing became very useful to us when in 1995, when we learned the online trading. You know, nobody had any hope that BSC will start online trading. Nobody had hope. So when we were doing uh, the entire testing mock trading which was going on for almost three months, we did not 
participants. On a daily basis, 70 participants were there. On the day we launched, 700 people logged into the system. Whole system crashed. Of course, it was a Friday. You know, we had deliberately launched it on Friday because we said if we have any problems, we can fix it over Saturday and Sunday. And and uh, you know, we used to be, I think, uh, on the thirteenth floor. And large number of brokers, they came, they grabbed us, they said, you don't know how to walk, you want to run, how can you have this system? We said, nothing do it, we will ensure that it is set right. You know, by Monday, everything will be be working fine and we work throughout the two days and we saw to it that uh, you know the system was working and that was 15th of January and you know there was budget on 28th February and everybody said look Budget is there, we can't take risk. Your system can collapse because there will be a lot of trading which will happen on 28th February. You please allow us to go back to the ring. We said nothing doing. We are not going to you know, go back. To the ring, we are going to use this system, and we, you know, we got lot of resources from USA. The tandem system, which was there, we got resources. We had them on standby, and you know, they used to charge something like nine thousand seven hundred dollars a week. Which was a lot of money, even at that point of time. But we said we will see to it that we make everything work. Otherwise, the kind of attack which was done on, done on two, three of us, you know, who were uh, actually managing the system, it was huge. But we said no, we are not going to get bogged down. This is a professional task which is in front of us, and we will see that we get it done. So, I think these are the kind of you know uh, continuous self talk. Continuously evaluating yourself, continuously thinking what I did yesterday, can I do it better tomorrow? You know, so, this is specially for women. I think we all need uh, to, uh, to take care of this, and I would really like to congratulate each and every one of you because you know I often say that women should not be trailblazers. You know, in a family there is one woman who has done very well and everybody keeps pointing at her. But it's it it should be so that person, her sister, you know, her mother, her aunt, her whoever, brother-in-law, uh, her sister-in-law, everybody should emulate the same thing, see what they are doing and get into 
doing outside the house and i think that would be a real contribution that each of you would make to this society uh, with that uh, thank you very much for inviting me uh, to speak to all of you all and uh, i am also listed as one of the mentors so any of you any assistance you require be it marketing be it hr be it technology accounts uh, anything i would be available